Researchers continue to make strides to treat cancer with innovative technological advancements. This week, an Israeli medical device company, Ice Cure Medical, received clearance from the FDA for its technology to treat liver and kidney tumors in addition to breast tumors. For more on this, we want to welcome the CEO of Ice Cure Medical, Al Shamir. Thank you for joining us. Hi, thank you very much for the opportunity. Many of us have heard of the recent trend of cryotherapy, but not cryoblation. Tell us how the latter works. This technology allows us to offer a minimally invasive solution while we are penetrating a needle to the tumor itself, very similar needle to a biopsy needle, and we are freezing and killing completely the tumors uh, within the body without doing any surgery, any removal of the tumor itself, but just killing it locally. Just a few days ago, the FDA issued additional clearance for your technology, and the timing is great for you and your team since you will be meeting with investors in Silicon Valley next week. How will this FDA clearance allow you to expand your presence and operations in the U.S.? In order to sell this technology in the U.S., you must have a specific FDA approval for specific intended use, like a kidney and liver, which will allow us to do claims and marketing and to expand and to create cells within new hospitals and clinics, which will allow us to grow our cells in a very important market. Now, IceCure has conducted clinical trials in the U.S. for patients with different stages of breast cancer. What have those results revealed? And do you plan on conducting clinical trials for other types of cancers? We conducted the biggest clinical trial on the early stage breast cancer, which in the U.S. you have last year uh, 320,000 new cases. Uh, we submitted and we presented in Congresses the initial results with only 2%. We are conducting a trial in kidney cancer and some independent trials like in lung and other organs as well. Now, does cryoblation eliminate the need for chemotherapy or radiation? Usually the cryoablation is just an alternative to a surgery. The additional treatment like hormone therapy, chemotherapy, or radiation, it's up to the doctors case by case to decide if to reduce it or, or even to eliminate it. But this is not something which is part of our protocol. Hey, Al Shamir, thank you very much again and good luck with meeting investors in San Francisco. Thank you very much for having me. Want to see more videos like this? Click on the link below and subscribe to One America News on YouTube and call your cable provider and kindly demand that One America News is added to your lineup. Call and subscribe today.